Hey, it's Aran here. In this video, I'm going to share with you how to cancel somebody's subscription in system IO, i.e. somebody who's subscribed to your membership and you want to cancel them. So I'm going to blur all the contact information, but this particular person asked to cancel their membership with me. And therefore what I do is you hover over the name onto the right. You see here on the right, it says unsubscribe. Now you will find this when you hover here on the product sales, click on subscriptions. And then you can filter, put the email address right here of the person and you will find your subscription. Then you're going to click on unsubscribe, which is this trash button button. And it will say confirm cancellation of the subscription. And you can, uh, I'll, again, the name is blurred out and you unsubscribe when the subscription period ends, which means that if they paid, let's say a week ago and it's a monthly plan, they'll still have another three weeks access. Or you click on subscribe now, which means their access will be cut immediately. In this case, relevant to my situation, I'm going to click on unsubscribe now, although in your situation, it might be the second one. Either way, it will still cancel them. Once it does that, you need to just give it a moment. And now it says here, you have been unsubscribed. So now you will see here status is X, whereas before it was a check. Now there might be some other settings you need to do. For example, if you go to contacts and you need to find that person again, you might want to change the tags for that person specifically. So what I'm going to do in my case, I've got a whole process on doing that. You might want to create a tag called churn as an example or some other tags. So that's something that is totally up to you, how you want to set things up. It's a little bit more advanced. In my case, I simply remove uh, the tag that is relevant to the access to the courses and stuff like that. And also if you cancel now, you might need to go to courses and also search for them again under courses. There's three different places, courses, subscriptions, and contacts. And uh, sorry, not courses, uh, students. So students, subscriptions, and contact. Contacts, that's the three different places. And under students, you might need to do a search depending on how they paid and stuff like that. So in my case, for example, this particular client just the way I have things set up, unfortunately, it's a little bit manual. I need to manually remove access to courses. So I got to click on uh, dismiss and then confirm and then do it with every single one of these, unfortunately, because I got a whole bunch of courses they get access to. So I just have it a little bit more complicated. You don't want to set it up the way I have it. Uh, I have it that way for the reasons that are not even worth getting into right now. But uh, you just want to make sure under students, subscriptions and contacts that the person has been unsubscribed the way you want it. So hope you get value in this video and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks a lot for watching this tutorial. I really appreciate it. So if you have not used system or haven't tested it out, you can actually create a free account. You're missing out big time. It is a great software. And all you gotta do is go to aranbukai.com forward slash SIO. That will take you to the system page. You enter your email, you create a free account, take it to a test drive. And when you feel confident, like you're ready to go and this is a good tool, the pricing is simply 27 a month, or you can also get 197 a year, which is pricing is not available on their website, but I have a special link for that if you want to take advantage of it. It's actually 10 times cheaper than the bigger competitors and so on, and it's a really good plan. So if you want to check it out, uh, go to rambukai.com forward slash SIO, and let me know once you had a bit of a look around. Uh, that's about it. If you have any other questions or tutorials that you'd like me to make on System.io, definitely let me know. Leave a comment below. I will do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. And uh, that's about it. Thanks. I'll speak to you soon.